Hey guys, I'm just making this quick tutorial to show you guys how to sign in on 4.84 on any custom firmware, Kex or Dex. Um, I'm going to show you guys right now when I try to sign in, I get the update error, as you can see. So I'm currently on uh, Rebug 4.81.2 D-Rex Cobra Edition. I'll show you guys that right now. Alright, so as you can see, I'm on 4.81 Dex. And if you're on Kex, this will work too, don't worry. And I'll see you guys on the computer. Alright guys, once you're at your PC, you just want to plug in a USB. I got mine right here. And then you want to go to the link in the description and download SCN Enabler. Once you download this, you just want to drag it to the root of your USB. And then you want to safely eject the USB and I'll see you guys back at the PS3. Alright guys, once you're at your PS3, you just want to plug in USB into the right USB port. And if you have a fat PS3, furthest to the right USB port. I got mine in right now. You want to go to Package Manager, Install Package Files, Standard, and then you'll see right there, just click X on it to install it. Once that's installed, you just want to open it up. Once it's loaded, it'll take a little bit to load, and then you just want to click X on it. And then go over to SCN slash PSN options, enable SCN access, click X on that. Once that's done, it'll say PSN slash SCN access enabled successfully. Do you want to reboot? You want to click yes, just to make sure that everything will be stable. So once we do that, I'll see you guys back at the PS3. Alright guys, once your PS3 was started, you just want to try and sign in. And as you can see, I signed in perfectly fine. I'll go down to show you guys my custom firmware. To show you guys that I am spoofed. And as you can see, it says 4.84, but I'm really on 4.81 dex. And that's how to spoof to it. Now, you guys can edit here. You guys can have fun modding. But I'm just going to show you guys how to disable it. Because whenever I make CFW tutorials, you always want to disable a spoofer before changing firmware. So I'm going to show you guys how to do that quickly. Once it's loaded up, you want to go back into SCN slash PSN options. And right there, it'll say disable SCN access. You want to click X on that and then click X again to disable it. And then your PS3 will reboot again. And then the spoofer will be disabled. And then you will be able to uh, change your custom firmware. So that's basically it. Please like, comment, and subscribe. Thank you.